How's your weekend? It was all right. I, with everything going on, I decided to rewatch The Irishman. <laughs> How was it? <laughs> with everything going on, it was a good way to start it. Well, it kills four hours. Yeah, it's four hours. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a great way to carpet bomb an afternoon. <laughs> Just Let's treat, just get to, to, to treat, nighttime. To treat an afternoon like a Gazan hospital <laughs> is by putting on the Irishman and getting some checks mixed. Yeah. Um, You're like, it's day now, and when this is done, it's going to be night. I, I've seen it twice already. This yeah, I've only seen it twice. This is the third time I watched it, and it's, uh, it's weird. It does not feel as long mm-hmm. on third watching once you know the story. It's, you can sort of go through it pretty quickly. Yeah. Um, but I'm, like, less tolerant of the de-aging thing. <laughs> it's awful. Well, I don't understand why he did it. I guess it's, like, at the time, I thought Martin Scorsese was going to die soon. Yeah. And so it was okay. <laughs> and now that he's, like, still making movies, it's, like... What the fuck? Why the fuck? Why didn't you just put fucking Leonardo DiCaprio in this movie? Yeah, just cast someone younger. Yeah, yeah. you have young actors you work with. Yeah, you could find one. No, his guy. reason for it is that younger actors wouldn't understand the mafia. That's what I read online. I was like, was there an artistic reason? Is there something that I'm just not getting? It's really insane. I mean, the face de aging is one thing, but the way he moves you know the his scene? body. You know the scene? Yeah, I mean, the, they should have had body doubles, but you know the scene where Robert De Niro's like working on his truck? And yeah. fucking Joe Pesci comes up to him and he's like, you know, he's like, yeah, he, the Y is on hooked up right or whatever the fuck. Yeah, yeah. Is. Robert De Niro's character is supposed to be 24 years old in that scene. <laughs> I looked it up. He's supposed to be 24. And he's like, yeah, you're, you're a good kid. And he's like, oh, thank you, I guess. Yeah, his voice is just yeah. grizzled. Yeah, mm-hmm. just like. <laughs> and then I guess the real Frank Sheeran had like blue eyes. Did he? So they have, they have, you know, but it just makes him look like, look, 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 look like he has cataract. <laughs> you know? It's really confusing. Yeah, when he throws the guy through the window or when he gets in that fight. Outside the building? Outside the building, yeah. yeah. Or outside the store. And he's just what? Yeah, he's like <laughs> kicking him. They had to like speed him up. Yeah. It's just, yeah, It's there's no reason to do it. Mm-hmm. I told you I saw the other one this, this week, last week. You could have, it would have been more effective if you cast actors with Down syndrome and did a D Down syndrome maybe <laughs> through CGI. <laughs> and said that say that actors without Down syndrome wouldn't be able to understand the mafia. Yeah, it's true. As speaking of, I saw there's like a video circulating of, of IDF soldiers beating up a Palestinian guy with Down syndrome. Really? Or like just jerking him around and ripping him away from his family. And he's like, he's like, oh, oh. Like, oh, like, no. He's like, no idea what's going on. Oh, no. But can you imagine that double whammy to be Palestinian and have Down syndrome? <laughs> I mean, I mean, honestly, it's a better way of coping with that reality. Yeah, but there's no, like... There's no candy. I mean, but beyond the candy, the, the, even the smaller things. Yeah. You know? Yeah. God damn it. That's really bumming me mm, out. Yeah. It's really making me sad. Yeah, no, he has, like, no idea what's going on. Oh, poor guy. Yeah. What's happened in the world? But, I mean, honestly, he's doing the heavy lifting. Yeah. It's him and the the and Bella Hadid, who I'm still not even really sure who that is. She's a, a beautiful woman, model, yeah. influence. It's that Down syndrome guy and Bella Hadid. They're pretty much the the queen, king and queen. Well, they do more. They do more to raise awareness than yeah. You know, just some guy. It's true. Some guy with a podcast on Twitter. Yeah, 